This is uh, the 21st of uh, October 2019 and Odin Bavi is performing a test of uh, for Vencon. We are using the Vencon underwater coating, underwater coating and we are 3.5 meters of depth. We are at location number 3 and the water te temperature is between 10 and 11 degrees Celsius. Okay, thank you, dude. Yeah, I'm gonna try to brush this train down here. <laughs> think it works a bit better with the spatula when I put a, a big layer on it. Yeah, exactly. And we all we basically need is a bigger uh, can to take the paint up because right now you only get uh, paint on one side of the spatula. Is yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> This has been applied at 11 o'clock, which is 4 hours and 15 minutes ago, water temperature 10. Uh, to the left, it has been applied with a brush, and to the right, it has been applied with a spatula. Try to poke it, let's see how it looks. Okay, when I try to poke it, I'm gonna use some rose. I can see, I can, I can make a little uh, mark, you see, from the gloss here. That's about it. And it, but it's very, like, rubbery, uh, hot. Test, a visual inspection and a test of Vencon underwater coating. To the right we have some coating that's been applied by a spatula. To the left we have some that has been applied with a, with a brush. Uh, it's been cured for, it's been curing for 24 hours in 10 degree water. Okay, Matthias, what do you see? Okay, so here to the right I applied this with the spatula yesterday and this I applied with a pencil. Brush. A brush, yeah. And um, yeah, it, it seems uh, smooth here and uh, and hot, and I cannot I cannot move it in any way. Uh, the same here, it's, it's not as smooth, but it's it's very hard as well. All right, cool. Try to scrape it a bit. I'll just try and scrape it here. Yeah. It's very uh, yeah smooth. So the hammer just slides smoothly over the surface. But it doesn't take any chips off or anything. Uh, I'm trying very hard now to to use my force to scratch it here. But okay, try to scratch with the same force on the steel just next to it. That's good. So we can see here we basically scratch into the bare metal uh, to the shiny steel. And uh, down here, well, nothing, mu not much happened. Well, this is very resistant. I would even say it's more resistant for scratches than the other one. Okay. Yeah. Let's try the same here. It could just be the color. I don't know, but it's it's very resistant to scratching. All right. And the same uh, here on this side, where it's applied with the brush. Yeah. Um, there's a little more edges, as you can see. So there's a little more to grab on with the. Hook. So it's, it makes a few more scratches, but it's uh, still uh, very resistant. Yeah, well, there's really not much. Try to pan to the right. I took a bit of the light on just to look at the right one. Uh, now when we have a little bit of light, yeah, there's really nothing to see. Oh, it looks very good. Okay. Even